So here is my version of a heated hummingbird feeder. What I took was a recessed can lighting for like overhead kitchen lights and I bought a infrared ceramic heater that screws into a light bulb socket and this particular one is a uh, 60 watt. I bought it at a PetSmart and basically just drilled three holes and put three galvanized steel wires in there that are 10 inches long and hung them from the feeder and just made little hooks so that you can change out the feeders quickly. And these hummers are getting crazy. And then uh, cut some hardware cloth out that's basically six inches by 15 inches and rolled it up to keep the birds from flying in there and burning their feet or anything. What do you think, Hummer? You like it? Nice and warm, huh? You're not afraid. Now you get some warm juice and warm body. It's a nice gentle heat coming up off this thing, too. It's just perfect. The birdies like it, don't you, birdie? They're all fighting over it. Okay, I'll let them drink. Oh, and then if you wanted to, you can also add a thermo cube. And that's just a little thermostat that clicks on at 35 degrees and it stays on until the temperature warms up to about 45. You can get those at Home Depot. They sell them all different temperature ranges, but 35 to 45 would pretty much be about the best range. And those are only like 15 bucks. This little uh, ceramic infrared heater was, ooh, I think, 19 bucks. They're kind of spendy, but they sell 60 watt, 100 watt, and 150 watt. And I think the, the higher wattage ones would be a little too warm, might end up melting the plastic or something. But now we got happy hummings, or happy hummingbirds. <laughs>